Bryan Jr. Uh, my job title is I'm a truck driver over the road and I am originally from Freeport, Illinois. I'm not usually one that's proud of my own accomplishments, but this one I am proud of because it's not easy out there. You know, every day we're dealing with uh, traffic and basically people who honestly, in my opinion and my co-driver's opinion, shouldn't even have a license, let alone drive. But hey, we've made it this far, so you know, we'll keep on plugging it in there and hopefully, you know, we'll continue to be, be with this company for as long as we can. Not getting too comfortable behind the wheel. I experienced it once a while back. There I became complacent a little bit in one of my turns and I ended up causing a preventable accident that fortunately nobody was hurt in. It made me really sit back and pay attention a lot more every day, every time I go out there. That I can't just take anything for granted, you know. You never know what's gonna come up, pop up out there. that, well, I'm mostly a nighttime driver, so in a lot of cases, there's not a lot of traffic I deal with. And I think that that's one of the biggest perks about being a nighttime driver. Anytime, anytime you're, you feel like the weather out there is threatening, you don't trust it, you know, keep yourself tr shut down, just, you know, once you become a truck driver, yeah, and any new truck drivers out there will know what I'm talking about. It'll, it'll scare you out there sometimes. You'll also learn from older, more experienced drivers what can be handled in a truck and what, what shouldn't be even tried in a truck. You feel unsafe, shut it down. That's, that's my best advice right there.